for today's spray paint art theme, we are going for a Christmas painting. Happy holidays to everybody watching. Thanks so much for tuning in this year. It's been a phenomenal year for spray paint art on this channel. Today's painting is pretty simple. We're gonna come in and create a nice little moon. If you guys don't know how to do this, make sure to check out the beginner spray paint art tutorial series. Uh, from there, I'm just gonna come in and shade my moon, add a little bit of white to highlight the bright side there, and come in with some Rust-Oleum quick color, pop down my lid, and I'm gonna go to work on my sky background here. So for this, I'm just experimenting with some colors, playing around with some brilliant blue, then I'm going to come in with some darker blue and just really working on that really subtle fade. I'm going to cover, you know, some of this up, but I'm still looking for that cool looking fade effect between the colors. Fading in some purple here onto our poster board. I'm using Art Skills glossy poster board to paint on today in Montana gold spray cans. Coming back in with some darker blue, just fading that back in. And I'm going to work in just a little bit of black to anchor those colors in the sky here. Just breaking up that colorful space a little bit. A little lighting adjustment for everyone and we're gonna come in with just a nice little bright burst in the background that's gonna brighten up our sky. We have made a uh, Santa Claus stencil for today's tutorial. I do have some tutorials on how to make these stencils in other videos. You're gonna see me flick on my stars here and reveal our nice moon. Hope everyone again is having an excellent holiday. Hopefully you get a break to spend some time with your loved ones. Maybe even sneak in some spray paint art. Thanks so much for tuning in today. This is a nice little simple painting you could do uh, with the holiday theme to it. So here I'm using a very skinny cap for the Montana Gold and I'm just blasting out some backlighting here almost in the shape of trees. Uh, for where I'm going to place down some trees for today's painting. To do this, I'm using a sea sponge. Uh, so that's like an artist style sponge. I'm spraying some black spray paint off to the side. And I'm just going to dab in uh, the outline of some trees here. So still using spray paint just off to the side, dabbing in our artist sea sponge and creating these happy little trees. If you guys like the general idea of today's painting, feel free to create whatever you actually would like. Uh, you're not bound to create the same exact painting. You're kind of creating your own little world. So feel free to explore and do something completely different uh, than me. You see me work these trees across here, just giving an anchor point for the foreground of our painting. I uh, was gonna just leave it with the moon, but I thought some wintry trees might be a little bit more effective. I've been doing a lot of these little trees in recent tutorials. So if you guys want to check that out, uh, make sure to check out the beginner spray paint art. I think it's called Tree and Galaxy Tutorial. I'm going to cover in depth exactly what I'm kind of doing in this painting here today. So now that I've worked in the general shape of my trees, the outline, uh, you're going to see me come in now with uh, a little bit more just to, to round out certain areas and make them look a little bit more natural. And then shortly here, I'm going to come in instead of black using a fresh piece of sea sponge, I'm gonna tap in uh, some white highlights here to these trees, giving it that wintry glisten, giving the snowy effect here onto our canvas, and just you know adding to the winter holiday vibe of this painting. I didn't wanna to go too full out Christmassy. I wanted something subtle, something that I'd like to have on the wall um, you know, any other time of year, and we're just gonna add in a little bit of a Christmas touch towards the end here. So you're gonna see these uh, trees come to life a little bit. You'll see me go back, work certain areas, just making sure everything looks natural and I get that nice kind of illusion of these Christmassy, wintry trees. If you guys want to be featured in a future spray paint art tutorial, make sure to head on over to the Reddit, submit your artwork, and I'll review it in a future video. We just did a video uh, with Reddit submissions yesterday, so check those videos out. And if you want to be featured, uh, make sure to join the subreddit and share your art with us here. Uh, so just a couple little touch-ups here, rounding things out a little bit. And then I'm going to come in with some Rust-Oleum quick color black and just give a nice little shadow effect uh, to the bottom edge of our painting here. 
couple very, very minor touch-ups. You see me touching the painting there. Uh, I want to make sure everything's going to be nice and dry before we toss our Santa Claus stencil onto this painting here. So just adding a little bit of shadow, a uh, couple little light touches just to break up that white. Just testing out the poster board to make sure everything is nice and dry. Last thing you want to do is toss on a stencil and destroy everything you worked so hard to create. Probably let this piece dry for pretty close to 45 minutes to an hour. There's the back of my head and neck looking like a pack of wieners. And we're all set up to toss in our Santa Claus and reindeer stencil here poster board there is just to hold down the border make sure there's no overspray you're going to see me in there with a very light touch of montana gold black taking off our border borders and peeling this thing back to reveal our beautiful santa claus theme painting thanks again everyone for tuning in i'm just going to play around a little bit with the shadows here and sign this painting make sure you guys don't forget to sign Make sure you don't forget to hit like and subscribe and I'll see you guys again in a future spray paint art video.